Hi, this is Ron Mitchell playing the Hunter on PC and we're on VDB because they've just released the Rock Ptarmigans. Can't believe that. Just dropped it like that. At surprise. <laughs> I've been doing the missions and everything. Forgot about those. Well, not forgot, but I didn't think it was coming this early. I thought it was going to be a few weeks away. So we've jumped on VDB. Uh, I'm using my Ibex tent location to first check out because I don't know where they are. I'm only supposed to be up where the ibex are so i thought if i do my ibex route i can take a look around and see if we can find one i don't know if they call how big groups are in or anything so it's a first look just a general look around for a start see if we can find any signs i don't know what they do with tracks it's all new to me so we're just having a look around in my normal ibex spots and then i'm going to just roam around hopefully catch a glimpse of one or maybe see one fly away or find a track or some kind of indication of where they are I will add in my tent locations around VDB if it helps you uh, or if I'm successful in finding them I think they'll probably be in areas uh, I'm I'm kinda guessing here but maybe uh, where there's like a plateau or something we can all sit I don't know if they're gonna be on high points such as real high ledgers, I'm not sure about that. Um, I don't know. But I'm just wondering if they spook easy or if they squat down like pheasants because they like relations to pheasants. So I'm assuming they'll have the same sort of behavior, probably the same kind of group numbers. What I'm doing is a bit carefree actually. I'm just going to run through this canyon, uh, check quickly. If I see no signs, then I'm going to go fast travel to my next tent. I've got a few tents set up, so that's what I'm going to do to quickly check the areas. Then when I find a rough location, then I'll start hunting from there. So I think that's the easiest way probably to find them. I'm trying to basically, if I scare them, then I know they're here, don't I? So I can hunt this area a bit more slower, and I know a rough idea where to go get them. You could do it the opposite way and take it really slow, but I think this is the easiest way to just find the rough locations for a start and then you can focus more once you know whereabouts they are so a bit carefree run through any any tracks indications that's what we're looking for assuming they leave tracks like I say I, I don't know but I think they will I think they'll just be like pheasants but they're just up in the mountains here so I don't know how small they are as well I'm just wondering if they're smaller than pheasants so if they are a rocky colour they're, they're going to be quite hard to see because if you look in front of me also I'm playing at 4k so it makes everything even really minute detail they are going to be quite hard to spot I'm not seeing anything yet um, not even an ibex so there's going to be a lot of people running around looking at rocks <laughs> What I'm going to do is run up a bit further and if I see nothing by then I'm just going to go to my next tent and then check that area. The next tent is on a, a bit more grassy area so it might be easier to spot them. One interesting thing I've just been thinking about is the animal population on VDB is actually quite low compared to other reserves. Um, we've done uh, extinction hunts before me and a few friends. Uh, we did a full day's hunt on it and tried to kill everything on it and we only got about 120 animals so the, the animal population on it is quite low really compared to places like loggers where you can get like 250 uh, to maybe 300 even uh, animals so I'm just wondering if they've changed the population of the other animals uh, as well as adding these or they've just added some of these in as well as um, the other animals so it'd be interesting to find that out. Um, right, I've just fast travelled to my other tent. I will give location uh, details, coordinates in the description of the video. Got an Ibex looking straight at me. <laughs> it's not what we're after. We're after rock ptarmigans, not you. Oh, there's a pretty nice one there actually. That's a good scoring Ibex as well. In fact, while we're here, I might as well shoot that one because I'm not going to pass that one up. That's a nice one. You never know, I might scare one in the air as uh, we shoot this and we can shotgun that one. Let's kill this Ibex, it is a nice male. 
I know we want uh, the ptarmigans, but when the nice smells like that, I'm not going to leave them. This area is a bit more grassy, um, the Ribex, so uh, they might make, make it a bit easier. There's a few more boulders than that, but it's more grass. The other rocky section we're just in, like I say, a nightmare to find them in there. If they're white, grey, or anything, I'm assuming they are looking like rocks or the colour because they're called rock ptarmigans. So, you know what I mean? It's going to be easier against green or brown than it is the actual stone colour. I'm still looking for tracks and stuff. Ooh. First uh, ptarmigan track. It's going to be interesting to see if they're in groups now. I think they will be in like the similar sort of numbers as a pheasant. It says around here. Yeah, look, there's, there's definitely a group, either one or two groups together. So this area does look good. Or a location, I should say. So I will stick the uh, cords for my tent in the video description. That should help some find them. Well, I've got to find them first, <laughs> so um, go claim Invicta before I get one yet. I think we'll collect this Ibex and then carry on. It looked quite a nice Ibex. Not as big as the one I had in the uh, missions, which was an absolute monster. But it's still a pretty decent one. Right then, come on Mr. Tarmigan, where are you hiding? Hopefully they are around here in a group. Where's the groups? There's some around here. One with that many tracks and nothing. I think they probably just squatted down somewhere close and I'm, I just can't see them. I don't know if they fly off and then come back down or what they do. I can't see any signs of them apart from those tracks we picked up with the feet and that and that's you know other visual indications and I haven't heard any calls or anything from them. So I don't think I don't know if they do call or not. I'm just gonna keep checking this area until I find probably the next tracks or just spot them. Like I say, I, I do think, that, like I say, the the in area where we've just been. With all those tracks, they've got to be close by. So I'm just gonna keep looking all around me, 360 with the binos, and hopefully spot one or some kind of uh, indication. We're out though, Mr. Ptarmigan. I wonder if they're inside the rocks, that's maybe why I can't see them. Is this a different track? What's this track? I wonder if they've flown as I've come. So I'm just gonna, no, I'll just keep checking here. It might be in the bushes. Like I said, I don't know how small they are. Maybe they're using the uh, Euro Bunnies uh, tunnels. Got an elaborate uh, plan made out. Oh, what's that? Is that one? Yeah, look, it's there. Wow, they are small. Really small. So we'll look close look at it. Yeah, it's got like a red cap on its head. Sort of like speckled white. It's a male as well. well I'm going to flush it. Oh, I've just seen one fly, I think. What we're going to do is flush this and uh, take it in the air. We don't want a ground shot. No, 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 don't go that way. Oh, we got him anyway. Oh, some more gun. No, no. Oh, we've got two, so that's not bad. So we've found our first ones. I'm going to take this one and uh, take a trophy shot of him. Get my first achievement. Rock Ptarmigan Dan. Very pleased with that. Take a nice cheeky little... Uh, Trophy shot, he's flying at you. He look pretty good. First achievement for the ptarmigan achieved. I feel like I've got to say that like an Irishman or something. Ptarmigan. Um, that might not be right at all. Sorry, I don't mean no any offence. Here's the second one. Right, let's click that one. 
So that's been me, Ron McTube, taking a, a brand new look at the Rock Ptarmigans, newly released on VDB. Please subscribe to my YouTube channels and thanks for watching.